Hi, everybody. This is Ev Zervodakis, and today we're going to talk about the angel number 444. So if you wanted to, if you missed the other angel numbers, um, you could go back and check them out on the YouTube channel. And remember that we provide on the Holistic Healing Astrology website other free materials for you other than these videos. We do blogs and I try to coordinate the blogs with the YouTube and we do a once a month newsletter. If you want to get more information on that, um, just sign up and uh, it's once a month and it's based on what people want to hear, what they've been asking for. We also provide services. Uh, most of the services, all the services have a life coach element to them, but I use the tools of astrology and uh, psychic medium readings or consultations to get answers for you and clarity. And it's a really great combination. And then I use the law of attraction among other things and the angel numbers. And that's why I decided to do these uh, videos about angel numbers. Yeah, everybody has their own take on angel numbers, but this is what I'm getting from my guides and um, they resonate with me. It, they make sense. So angels are part of the invisible world out there that um, gives us information. It's very subtle. That's why you have to keep your eyes open and even your ears. Because when you hear an angel number or see an angel number like 444, just know that the angels are around you at this moment. And they love you. They want to help you. And um, because the angels are kind of unemployed unless you call on them. What do you mean by that? I mean that because of free will, and I keep saying it over and over, but we need to understand that the creator, God, you know, universe, source, whatever, when they create, when we were created, we have all the human resources available to us to help us to achieve our dreams and our highest goals. We're not here to suffer. I don't believe that. Yes, the world has dualistic uh, elements to it. There's good and bad. There's dark and light. There's cold and warm, but that's how we learn. This earth plane, we are here to learn lessons. And the angels will never become human. They were never human. They are angels. They're messengers of God. It's in all the ancient texts and literatures uh, out there, but they are there to supply help for us when we get tired, when we're weary, when we do look at the negative instead of the positive, when we lose faith and we don't have trust. That's when the angels are there to help you because sometimes you know, we don't take advice and you've been there. I've been there. I've been given advice and I don't listen. And even now at my age, you know, there I'm working on stuff every day. I'm not done. And we're not done until the moment we take our last breath. And that's when we're done. And that's when we have the end of the world. I don't believe in like, oh, we're going to have doom and gloom. Chicken little, the sky is falling down. It's World War III. Uh, computers are all going to go haywire. All this negativity, we could choose to accept that reality or we could just have our own reality. You know, think back with the wars, that thousands and thousands of wars over history from, from the beginning of mankind. How many different wars have we had? But yet our planet is expanding. There's population growth, even with all the viruses out there, even with bioterrorism, even with the wars, it doesn't matter. So you could sit there and, you know, get all upset about it and think about all the disasters that could happen. The price of gas has gone up. Oh my God, the electricity is going up. My taxes are going up. How am I going to pay for everything? Yeah. But you know what? Look at right now. Are you able to pay for everything right now? Focus on that. Don't go down that rabbit hole of negativity because that is what you create in your life. You, what you focus on is what you create. So if you're focused on all the doom and gloom out there, all the negativity, 
but you're able to change your life. So one of the things I highly recommend is to pay attention to the subtleties, pay attention to your thinking, and the angels are called to do that too. So in this, we are going to talk about the 444. And the 444 is just telling you that at this moment, you're surrounded by the angels. They're here to help you. Please call on them and continue to let me know what your thoughts are. Comment, share, and like below. Uh, also, you know, um, I appreciate all my clients, all the feedback. I thank you for allowing me to come into your world. I know we're all very busy and we will talk soon. Thank you very much.